Hey guys, um, today I'll show you how to upgrade your RAM of HP NVM6 1125XD. I'm gonna upgrade the RAM from 6GB to 12GB uh, and I'm gonna install this. Take out that 2GB and install that 8GB so it'll be a total of 12. So what you'll need is a screwdriver and that's all I need for this one because um, for this laptop it's really easy you don't have to open everything because you could just take out the screw here and when you open that everything's there including your hard drive, RAM, your Wi-Fi and yep so first thing you have to do is turn off your laptop close it and make sure you have something to put it on so it won't get scratched and since I already um, unscrewed this uh, screw right here I'm not sure if you see that right there um, I'm just gonna take off the battery and press this again and push it out okay so it's right there there's my hard drive and it's HDD it's not S SD I believe correct me if I'm wrong but anyway here's my RAM what I'm gonna do is um, my bad yeah, I don't, know if you, I don't know if you can see that. Let's see. Okay. Just gonna press this two button, the opposite side, opposite direction, and it's just, just gonna pop out like that. But since I already know this one is two gig. Uh, If you can see it. Oh, it's upside down. Wow. Okay, right there. And um, now I'm gonna install this. All right. So I took it out from the box, or whatever you call it. And I'm gonna show you how to put it back. It's pretty much just. Because there's a notch right here, right there. And you gotta align that with the same one over there or else it won't fit, it won't go in. So you have to align it uh, 30 degrees, I believe. It doesn't really, I don't exactly know how many degrees is that. But um, just put it in. And right, let's see, there you go. You gotta put a little bit of force in there and just push it down and then it'll just click and that's it and after that yeah you just have to put it put everything back there you go your bat my battery and last thing is um Start it up and see if it works. And make sure you put the screw back. That's the one I forgot. But I just want to test it first and show you guys if it works or not. So, you know. There you go.
All right, now it's here. Let's All right. You just go to um, computer, right click, and press property, properties, and um, all right, it works. There you go. All right, guys. See you later.